Oh, what's up, YouTube? It's your girl. Back at it again with Goku story in Dragon Ball. Dragon Ball Sparking Zero. Uh, we almost lowered the difficulty, but you know what? We don't. We ain't no bitch. We play at the. We play at the normal difficulty of the game. We're gonna fight the Ginyu Force. I think I might vary it up a little bit. I did invite people from the chat room if they would want to join and like be a part of the silly stuff and like actually fight people are like more than welcome to actually join let me actually double check that that pin because i had a, a technical issue literally like not even like 20 like two seconds ago so let me fix the pin for everybody my stream literally like died because my graphic card so we'll see if we'll see if this recording works i don't know the ginyu force is right before us <laughs> The first blood is mine to draw. Remember, Guldo, orders were to only kill one of them each. Don't get greedy. Yeah, yeah, I got it. Hi. Hi, I'm Goku. I'll give you one last chance to leave this planet peacefully. I'd take it if I were you. What did you say? Ha <laughs> ha, what a gentleman this guy is, Guldo. Caring about your well-being. Dude, we need to get you a new PC for wild demons. I'm gonna... I want to play it with you. Damn Saiyans for getting their place. I'm going to show you why the whole galaxy fears the Ginyu Force. The whole galaxy doesn't even know who you are, Guldo. <laughs> Let alone the Ginyu Force. Is he just going to let me enter sparking? He is. Fuck it. Spirit bomb him, right? This works every time. This works every time, right? Just throw the spirit bomb. <laughs> what? What, dude? We're too good. Vegeta, you're right. Wait, I actually killed him? Outright? Holy fuck. Well, well, that was canon, right? Goku spirit bombed him. <laughs> <laughs> we're we're spirit bombing the Ginyu Force now. That's what we needed to do. Thanks, Vegeta. Vegeta became annoyed witnessing Goldo and Goku's battle. He begins arguing that they have no time to fight one on one. The Ginyu Force agrees with Vegeta's proposal and, joining up with Goldo, they all come together to attack Goku and his friends. Well, Vegeta. You maggots clearly don't understand, so I shall illustrate. We are the best of the best of the Frieza Force. Nay, the entire galaxy! Riku! I love the Ginyu Force. Nice. Ginyu! <laughs> I love them so much. They're so cheesy. I love them so much. They're so corny. Oh shit. Oh shit, what the fuck? I thought I was blocking there. Oh shit. Nice. Um, okay. Can I swap to Vegeta by chance? Okay, well, whatever. I'm gonna grab him. Oh, well. I dropped my combo. Whatever I was trying to do. Oh, shit. I have to dodge that. I have to dodge roll that like it's Dark Souls or something. Oh, God. I'm actually getting worked by him now. Never mind. Game's hard. Fuck it. Wait. 
You actually can't break out of back attacks. Okay. Okay. I keep getting paralyzed by him. This is not going to work out. Oh, no. Being beaten by a bald short guy. Yelp. You have to actually get behind them, okay. I'm getting excited. Oh, did I just get comboed? Oh shit, I tried to charge that. Well then let's kill him real quick. Oh. Let's go. That didn't work. got the little guy taken care of. I have like no HP, <laughs> bro. This is scary. I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. I just like got owned by Guldo, and then Raccoon comes out. He's like, "Wait a minute." <laughs> oh god, I actually have to win this, don't I? Like that. I have to remember, there's like a move to like dodge back. His like key blast is really annoying. Oh fuck. I have no reactions. Oh shit, I tried to grab. I have to like actually be aware of that. I don't know why I'm failing that so so hard, but you know what? It's fine. What's he gonna do? Oh, he actually stunned me. I had something in my eye. Yeah. Actually, I have to wipe my eye, I think. Yeah, no, it's like actually like really in my eye. Holy fuck. Yeah. I have to remember to like use my powers too. So I get like my buffs, right? Okay. I felt like I had a good handle on it when I was playing in the trading, but now I'm like super confused. Well, now he's dead. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it. We spirit bomb. Fuck it. We do it. Before it runs out of the meter. Oh, never mind. Raccoon's too good. Oh, that was actually kind of sick. I was trying to do like a low sweep. Oh shit, that was actually kind of fucking sick. I had no idea what the fuck was going on for a moment there, but I did something right. That's for sure. This works. This is a combo. True combo. Oh, it wasn't a true combo. No, it was. Yeah, 15 hits. Oh. Raccoon lost his fucking armor like he does in the anime. It's cool. Need more key charge power. Is He just lost. I think he's lost. I think he just like got really confused. Well, we won. Raccoon's dead now. Who's next? Jace? Your 
Birder? Well, here we go. I broke his Alabama brain. Oh. We're not taking another step. Goku, this one will be my opponent. Guess I'll be having the leftovers then. Hey, Raccoon, you owe me another chocolate parfait for being such a team player. Oh, oh well. Well, fuck it. I think this will actually still works. <laughs> I'm gonna do it anyway. Who cares? You run out of the sparking meter eventually, so... Yeah, no, I think that actually true comboed. Yeah, 10 hits. Holy fuck. You have forever to combo off the launcher. Into super. That's actually kind of intense. Oh, counter hit me. Oh, I tried. Oh, shit. <laughs> Wrong move. Holy fuck, dude. The AI started... He did combos. Oh, no. He actually had strings. That's fucking crazy. He did like a 30-hit combo to me. Backshot style. I think I had Vegeta, too. It's totally my fault. You think I can just Kaioken him? <laughs> no. <laughs> He'll dodge out of the Kaioken like that. Oh, fuck. I need to remember to use the vanishing attack a little bit more. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it, I think this works. I'm trying to figure shit out though. I feel like I'm doing a lot better than I did when I first played the game. That's for sure. I think he's dead. No, he's not. I don't know where he is though. I'll full charge on your ass if you, if you just let me. I'll do it, bro. Raccoon will get annihilated with the like spirit bomb frame one. Bro, I'm actually surprised that it's so... Like, it's actually kind of genuinely pretty difficult here. Yeah, and I'm solo, so... Oh. That wasn't a super. I love him! He's so funny. What a goofy boy. Okay. I tried to counter that. Okay. I had to like do my moves. I get horny and stuff like that, right? Shit. Oh shit. Fuck. Okay. Holy moly. Dude. He's actually just hitting super counters on me like over and over again. That worked. Oh, this I mean, I'll have forever to charge my sparking meter now. Oh, back shots. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it, we ball. We kill him. This definitely combos because it's like a long launcher. 
I didn't mean to do that launcher, but you know what? Fuck it. We ball. I think he's actually dead. He's dead. Birder's in. You're a little tougher than I thought. I'll kill you quick. You're not taking another step, Goku. Oh, I got Tien. Guess I'll be having the leftovers then. Hey, Riku, you owe me another chocolate parfait for being such a team. Oh my God. Let's go. Fuck it. We raw spirit bomb. I don't think this is going to work. I don't think that's big combos. I feel like I should have done it off the launching attack. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Holy shit. I need TN. Save me. Woo. Oh, he countered me. Boom. We're in there. Give me your energy. Bitch, I'm Goku. What do you mean? Oh, I countered. I'd like dodge that. That was pretty sick. Oh, I actually hit the counter attack there. He has to hold this now. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck you. Oh, shit. Oh, never mind. Raw into spirit bomb, though. Oh, it didn't work. Cow can rush? Will this work? I think this will. Yeah. That was really sick. Who's next? Oh, I actually can't change. I guess that makes Goku the new fastest in the universe. Being a number two fits you pretty well, though. Shut your face. Boy, are you gonna waste the whole It's the Australian motherfucker. Sizzle will hate him. <laughs> Cause it's such a fucking it's such a fraudulent Australian accent that Sizzle would be like, that's eh, not a real one. Look at this shit. I actually have to win this still. I don't know if I have to fight Ginyu right after or anything too. That's crazy. I'll go all the way, bro. Oh shit. Well fuck it. Will this work? I don't think it works. Well we missed. Uh spirit bomb then. Fuck it. <laughs> Beam clash me or something. Don't be a pussy. Watch him just take it to the face. It's actually kind of hard to dodge the spirit bomb. Okay, bro. Back shots? Cool. I have to fight Ginyu, okay. Shit. About time the strongest of the bunch joined the party. Oh shit. <laughs> Toria! Oh no, not the back shots. I'm fucking dead. Not good. Shit, I was just charging his face. I can't do anything about this. Shit, I tried to move. Holy fuck. I have to be five dudes in one set. Okay. It's just like a lot of health bars to get through. I try to do something a little bit secret. Oh, nice counter attack, but it's fine. It's just five guys. It's 
<laughs> it's five guys in fries, though. But it's also, I only have like 50,000 HP, I think, or 40,000 HP. So they just have a massive health pool. <laughs> Okay, well at least he's not like comboing me hard like he did the other time. You had five guys recent for the first time, it was good. Like the actual like burger place? Yeah, it's pretty good. I've had it like once or twice I think. Yeah, the actual burger place? Oh, that's crazy. I didn't think they'd... Were you in the States or something? Oh my gosh. Oh, that was good, actually. I need to remember that one. Oh shit, I thought I could meme him and just throw key blast and finish him. You're not taking another step, Goku. This one will be my opponent. Yes, I'll be having the leftovers. Okay. They're starting to expand. It was in Belgium? Oh, cool. I wonder if it's like I always like wonder when it comes like food places it how like consistent they are from like country to country. Doesn't approach, just go to sparking. Who cares? Right? Just just like spirit bomb spam this shit. True combo into spirit bomb. We'll fucking win. It won't be that bad. Do it as many times as we have to. This is not a real fight anymore. We will We will fight with as cheap as we fucking can. Shut your face! It worked again, dude! <laughs> I think- I feel like sparking makes the fucking story mode very trivial. It doesn't seem like they really do much to try to deny you from getting it, right? Like, look, I just like, mashed up to it, right? Oh shit. Got a boost. Like when when I try to fight them like for real for real. Like they, they get they throw they throw some serious fucking hands. Oh my god! Dickhead! I can't fucking get out of this, too. Like, look look at how much fucking damage he did! <laughs> like, he did two whole fucking health bars of damage to me. I'm going to die to Ginyu now because of that. Like, because Ginyu's like, in my back. Okay, cool. Fucking great. I was doing so well. I was doing so well. Like, so fucking well, actually. I can't even see the fucking situation that's going on. Takes one bar to go and do. Sparking. I deflected his shit. Fuck you. Fuck you! I'm gonna go crazy. I don't care anymore. That like... Oh, dude. He literally did like three health bars of damage to me, that that Jace guy. Because he got like one really good combo in and I didn't have like any resources and like... I mistimed all my fucking counter hits. 
That's fine. I'll do another one. Fuck. This will win. <laughs> this will win. <laughs> Bro, I'm gonna... Holy shit. I'm surprised. Did I get being by such a weakling? Goku, you okay? I've got the little guy taken care of. Hey now, it's bad manners to interrupt somebody's business. Oh, I missed my timing there. It's fine. It's fine. We're gonna just spear bomb him anyway, right? I got I got some damage off. We'll do the spear bomb now. I think the Kaioken Kameha is like really cool. Or the Kaioken Rush, whatever it is, where he does like basically where he, it looks like he's fighting Vegeta. Finishing your ass. You're dead. You're so dead, bro. Get out of here. I feel like I'm getting a lot better, though. I'm like, a lot, like, understanding my strings and stuff that I have. I feel like he's dead. He's not dead. Okay, well, that's a full charge for me. So that's sick. Honestly, kind of worth it. Oh, shit. I have to boost this, then. Taking another stout, Goku. This one will be my opponent. Guess I'll be having the leftovers then. Hey, Raccoon, you owe me another chocolate parfait for being such a dear. Okay, that'll work. That works. It's like really delayed on like being able to get the super out from like a launcher. But it true combos every single time, so it's fine. Give me your energy. I need it for my spirit bomb spam. Oh shit. Ooh, good counterattack though. Got him. Got him. Got the timing on that. Let's go, baby. Alright, Jace. Oh fuck. I really just want to fucking go in. Yeah, I have to like spend it all. Really? Why? Does it just like spend my Kamehameha when I'm doing that? Oh. The super counter is so annoying when they hit it. Oh fuck. Oh fuck it. Hopefully this combos. <laughs> It might, because he has to fall so far. He might have just raw taken it. Yeah, he took it raw. Me too, Goku. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck it. I don't want to deal with this shit. I'm so, like, over it. We won. He's dead now. We have, like, 35,000 health to deal with Ginyu. Oh no. Turn brick is shit. <laughs> I'm really afraid he's gonna hit like the body transfer technique or something like that. 
Oh shit, he recovered real fast. Actually did a solid recovery in there. Oh my god! I did not mean to do that. It worked though. It really fucking worked, point blank like that, okay. Um, fuck it. We won. Expand Dong, holy shit. This is absurd! The Ginyu Force is unstoppable! Unstoppable, I tell you! Nah. Holy shit. That was a lot harder than everything else before it. And that includes Great Ape Vegeta, which apparently everybody's like getting skill checked by. Combining their powers, Goku and Vegeta. Go Vegeta didn't do shit! Force the Ginyu Force to retreat, seeing that their will is broken, Goku orders them to return to their planet. Instead, the Ginyu Force spots an opening and tries to kill Goku while his guard is down, only to be cut cut down themselves by Vegeta. After Vegeta's devastating attack, it was only Ginyu who remains when the enemy freezer enemy freezer emerges, yep. Freezer orders Ginyu to search for the Dragon Balls as Ginyu leaves, Vegeta follows in pursuit. Next, Go Freezer offers Goku and his friends a chance to join the Freezer Force. Goku, of course, turns this offer down, but he can sense that Freezer is far stronger than any enemy they faced before. Why are we facing them on Earth? I don't really like this. It is then that Vegeta, who's supposed to be pursuing Captain Ginyu, returns to Goku and the others. Before they know what's happening, Goku Vegeta begins attacking Goku and friends. Oh, okay. Now I can know how strong Vegeta truly is. With a oh. first hand experience. I see. Vegeta, what do you think you're doing? Ginyu uh, Vegeta. Ginyu, before exterminating the Earthlings, you should take care of that other Saiyan. Yes, my lord. That's Ginyu? What, what the hell's going on? Is Vegeta betraying us or what? I'm not sure. But we have to keep on fighting. Or it I think it would be funny if Freezer was like, Vegeta? So I have to fight Body Swap Vegeta. And this is gonna be like toaster easy compared, watch. Kakarot, don't you dare injure my body! Is that can you? Wait, your body? No, no way! Slow on the uptake, aren't we? Yes, my special power allows me to swap bodies with another. Vegeta strength is like he's dead now. Like I already won this fight. That's how. That's how fucking fucking different the level of difficulty was from that last fight to this fight. Like this is basically already over. Vegeta has no HP. Have you forgotten my orders to obtain the Dragon Balls? No, of course not, Lord Frieza. But I haven't yet located it. Oh, he's dead. Boom. I haven't found a power level high enough to. You're dead, Ginyu. But, but why? Even using Vegeta's body, why can't I kill you? Hmm. It's almost like when you had like six people with like seven billion HP to go through, it was a lot harder. And I did. I, I for some reason I couldn't swap characters. Maybe I could have. I'll just take your body instead. <gasps> Change now. No. Kakarot, get out of the way. <clears throat> <laughs> I knew you'd use your power again soon enough. You've <laughs> outlived your usefulness, Vegeta. Oh. I'll wind up with a lower power level, but desperate times call for desperate measures. Change now! Is he wanting to take over TN? Stop! Is it Gohan? Oh shit. Getting your temp early so TN narrowly avoids having his body stolen. You froze for a second. What happened? That technique, it must be. Is it Chaozu? Hey! Actually, just froze him in time. <laughs> or best friends, Shotsu follows behind, being careful not to be noticed. 
Chaozu uses his telekinesis to change Ginyu's body with a frog and the battle is won. Well, sure. And soon for the wounded Goku and Vegeta, Krillin and the others hand them a sensu bean to heal. Even to them, it's painful, painfully clear that Goku cannot free defeat Freezer alone, and that Vegeta's help will be required. However, Freezer is engaged in rage at seeing the underlings beaten, and he goes after Goku and the others. Unable to bear seeing his friends hurt anymore, Goku challenges Freezer to a one-on-one -on -one fight. You wish to do battle with me one-on-one? -on -one? <laughs> I have never encountered such an overconfident imbecile in my whole life. <laughs> I'll let you in on something, Kakarot. Freezer's race can transform to become stronger. Really? Well, someone's done his homework, hasn't he? So you know my little secret? Let's just say some of your elite soldiers have loose lips. He can transform? You mean like that great ape stunt you pulled? You <laughs> mustn't put me in the same league as your hideous transformation. In my case, I'm merely holding back the full force of my awesome power. Oh yeah, Frieza? If that's the case, go ahead and transform. I wouldn't want you to feel the shame of being defeated without being at your full strength. <laughs> oh, you're going to suffer dearly for such an insult. Rejoice. You will have the honor of being killed by my transformed state. Brazil looks so stupid in first stage. Now, feast your eyes. What incredible energy. Oh. I got grabbed. Okay. You're in for it now. My second form makes the one you're familiar with. Ooh. Ooh. Dragon Ball shit. That was fucking. That was Dragon Ball, baby, for a moment. Crazy. Now I'm just gonna spirit bomb you though. For the, <laughs> I got my I got my spirit bomb point in. But I feel like I don't have to deal with it that much because the HP should be relatively even, so I don't feel like I have to like rely on like being cheesy. I do want to like play the game. Cool. Oh, nice. Oh, I tried to break that grab. Okay. Nice. This is taking longer than I wanted. We got him in the booty. Nice. He's, he's like still just standing though. That's so disappointing. I know I know how this goes. He's gonna get he's gonna get stronger. He's gonna get a big dick mode. Oh, look at him. He got aroused. Freezer is in the midst of the next step of his transformation and intends to show Goku and his friends just how much power more powerful than him he really is. Um I think the Ginyu Force was more powerful than you're gonna be. I'll be honest. And to further plunge Goku into the depths of despair. Freezer orders his soldiers to eliminate Goku's wounded allies. Oh, it's Roshi, though. Just as a legion of troops appear from Freezer's spaceship, Master Roshi arrives to bring Chaozu back home. Our heroes give the last of their sensu beans to Goku and entrust him to defeat Freezer, while Freezer's soldiers, despite their own wounds, what? Armed with the sensu bean and the hopes of his companions, Goku takes the battle to Freezer one last time. What's up, Godzilla? How are you, baby? Kakarot. It's fun. Vegeta. I think it's alright. It's pretty cool. <laughs> Vegeta. Are you afraid? Oh. Have you realized that even combined your power pales in comparison to mine? Level 3 Freeza sounds fucking cool. Holy shit. Kakarot. Even you wouldn't be stupid enough to fight Freeza if you didn't think you had a chance of winning. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's right. If I use my spirit bomb technique, I think I can beat him. But even then, it's got such a slim chance of working. Gathering enough energy for it takes more time than we have. What the, what the hell are you going to do? I'm not risking the others' lives in this battle. So if we don't have an opening, I'm just going to have to make one. <laughs> Idiot. 
It's a futile effort. Neither you nor I have any chance of beating him. How could a low-class warrior like you ever hope to topple Frieza? Ooh. Okay. Let's go. Both in the sparking, baby. Fuck it. Oh. I can't spirit bomb him. Let's go. Kamehameha. Fuck his ass. Give me your energy! You want a treat? Uh, I'm having a parfait. It's pretty good. It's like fruits and yogurt. And some, uh, like... Granola. <laughs> what the fuck? How'd I do that? It's pretty interesting. Oh god, I'm out of meter. Oh, actually did the thing there. Jesus, this became very Dragon Ball. I was trying to delay my attack. Share your energy with me. Okay, never mind. Breeze at level three is actually fucking my ass right now. Holy shit. Oh no, not the perception. I'm trying to charge in his face. Nice. Okay, I'm not losing losing yet. Ooh. Ooh. Oh my god. Dude. It's been amusing, but I've grown tired of this charade. So oh. I believe it's time to end this poor excuse for a- Oh my god, I'm dead. Wait. Oh. Yeah, no, it's yogurt with, um, with fruits and, uh, stuff. With fruits and granola. It's really good. It's called a parfait. <laughs> this is going to be a fun fight, though. I like it. Again! <laughs> Again! We'll combo in like that. You're making me break off the shackles, Frieza. Come on. Oh, shit. I, I'm trying to fucking counter hit him like a troll. <laughs> Fuck it, point blank Kamehameha. It's been amusing, but I've grown tired of this charade. So I believe it's time to end this poor excuse. I tried to to do a thing. My oh my god, super counter my super counter, okay. Bastard. The privilege of seeing my final transformation. My true power. Oh, he actually fucking healed. Oh, shit. Wait a minute. The wait is over. Now I will show you a terror far greater than hell itself. <laughs> fucking A, dude. 
What was that? Oh, I get a special throw on Frieza. That's funny. Oh, shit. What the? Vegeta. Okay. Okay. Forgive me. Vegeta. Don't shut up. You're far more wounded than I am. Don't start giving me your worthless sympathy. Oh my god. You're nothing like any Saiyan I've ever met in my entire life. Warrior who fights to protect people they care about. Such a nature was frowned upon in our culture. Vegeta? You still don't understand what it means to be Saiyan. So now oh my god. The example. You'll never learn when it's time to lay down and die, will you? Vegeta! Sucks that the biggest drawback to making a strong enough spirit bomb. Now we're gonna win this with Vegeta. Fuck it. Fuck it, we ball with Vegeta, baby. This is kind of sick. This is actually really fun. I like it. Oh, we won. Look at that. Boom. Look at that gunshot with the freaking dirty fireworks. That was, that was, but <laughs> Vegeta just got that work. Vegeta really is stronger than Super Saiyan Goku. I'm just saying, bro. He just, he came in. Freeze's perfect form, not a problem. What's this? Is that what I think it is? I've never seen a mass of energy that size. <laughs> How unfortunate for you. Don't you hate it when a plan falls apart? I know I certainly do, but nice try. No! No, damn it! Special beam <laughs> Damn! Let's go. Piccolo! What are you doing here? How is that brat? And that Namekian still drawing breath? I thought they'd been taken care of! I'm beset on all sides by sneaky parasitic flies! You just won't rest until I've been pushed to the limits of my patience! You meddling brats! I hope you all enjoy suffering the same fate as this planet! Okay, it's finally ready! Do it! Go, go! <laughs> it's so cheesy, bro. I love this shit. Dragon Ball can be so funny. There we go. Freeze has been dealt with, guys. Help of his friends, Goku successfully defeats Freezer with the Spirit Bomb. Goku asks why Piccolo and the other Namekians are on Earth, as they should be on planet Namek. Yeah, why are we still on planet Earth, bro? Seems as if Piccolo and the others have been able to immediately teleport to Earth by using the Dragon Balls on Planet Namek. Wow, really? Typically, true heroes are the only ones worthy of obtaining the Dragon Balls. However, once it's discovered that the God of Earth is a Namekian, permission to use the Dragon Balls was granted. Afterwards, a Namekian boy called Dende uses his mysterious power to heal the wounded. Just as Goku and friends are expressing their gratitude, a fully recovered Vegeta appears. Vegeta! This is where our alliance ends, Kakarot. <laughs> I will no longer be fighting alongside you people. Yeah, Vegeta solos. He's crazy. Mark my Just words. OP. One day soon, I will defeat you. I, be I bet he beats Melania Blade of Mikola or whatever, right? Seriously? Ugh, I was this close to inviting him to the victory party, too. <laughs> <laughs> Who knows? Maybe he'll show up when the party starts. I think we're growing on him. Actually, the next time we see Vegeta, I think he'll be intending to fight us for real. For what? real. And like you said, who knows? Don't scare me like that, Goku. <laughs> I hope they have a GT storyline. His army won't be a threat to Earth anymore. 
Yeah, and if Vegeta does come back, I doubt it'll be anytime soon. I really like I really like GT when it's abridged and like the villains of GT. I think they're really fun. Like yeah. designs. Well, I don't know about you guys, but I'm totally starving. Thanks to the bravery of Goku and the others, Frieza. That was it? I didn't get to go Super Saiyan? Planet Earth and the whole galaxy are at peace for now. The war was won, but the battles are far from over. For there are many other fearsome foes <laughs> on the horizon. Oh yeah, I haven't shown you guys this. There's a first person mode. You can you can watch cutscenes from first person. For Goku and the rest of our heroes, <laughs> the saga Look at this shit. <laughs> it's definitely supposed to be viewed from this angle. It's really funny though, isn't it? <laughs> vegetarian. I'm not a vegetarian right now. Let's go. I'm on a good diet that's like very lean, but yeah, I'm, I'm eating meat again for a little bit. Play the side by side story in Goku Saga. Okay. Huh. Really? Is it because I beat him with Vegeta? They're supposed to like keep going. No, I know you are. I'm trolling back with you. Here goes. Yeah, I think I'm supposed to like not one with Vegeta. Oh shit, I fucked up. Sorry, boys. Oh, you naughty little girl, you. Yeah, I... From what I understand, there's some, like, alternate endings you can get. Like, not endings, but, like, alternate, like, outcomes. I think maybe we got one of the alternate outcomes because I didn't, like, last long with Vegeta. I just, like, murdered. Which is, like, it was cool that I got it, right? Oh, shit. We're just gonna use it. Fuck it. I don't think this is gonna work, though. Yeah, you can block it. Okay. Ooh. Okay, I tried to teleport. Oh, I tried. Ooh, got him. I'm like destroying Frieza right now. Boom, 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 boom. It's been amusing, but I've grown tired. You've grown tired of it, Frieza? Well, so Kaioken! It's time to end this poor excuse for a battle. And my reward to you for all your valiant efforts. The privilege of seeing my final transformation. My true power! Okay, I was trying. Oh my god. Actually had like a full like true combo there. I was trying to counter it, but the wait is over. Now I will show you a terror far greater than hell itself. Oh my god. What are you waiting for? Eat that last sense of being Oh no. I'm actually stunned. Oh, because I overboosted. Hi, Vegeta. Vegeta. But, but what about just eat the damn thing before I burn it to ashes with the last of my strength? Just forgive me, Vegeta. Don't oh, shut up. You're far more wounded than I am. Gala gun. Don't fuck it. Giving me your worthless sympathy. Oh, she. Any I've ever met they actually like did life. the thing. A warrior who fights to protect people they care about. Such a nature was frowned upon in our culture. Vegeta? Oh my god. I still don't understand what it means to be safe. So now I'll set the example. Oh. Explosive wave's different here. 
Oh shit. Oh shit. Actually counter me. That was fucking great. Good job, me. I want to use the Gallic Cannon. Oh. Oh my god. Take what's left of our energy as much as you can muster. Guys, you're alive? Perfect. The spirit bomb has grown big enough to take down Frieza for sure now. Thank you, everybody. Is that it? Okay. Yeah, no, I think I actually have to win. Okay, then. That, that kind of fix that kind of like fix is that right oh god no we're to fucking die now oh my god freezer what oh no oh my god fuck it we ball oh this might actually <laughs> this worked well Well, that that worked. Okay, so we didn't have to outlast him. I feel like Goku Saga ending like that's really short, though, right? Huh. What's the? Oh, I can't just like skip this cutscene. Okay, great. I have to wait for it to like load a little bit and then I can skip things. Okay, so what did we... How did we get to the Cell Game Saga then? Do I have to just... Huh. If I press continue, will it go on? Because it's the same mission. I did side by side, right? Like, that's the thing. Yeah, we're here. I'm so confused. The what ifs are confusing. Yeah, what the fuck did I do wrong, Milo? Like, where did I go wrong? Because, like, Frieza is dead, and that's it. What's up, Sizzle? How are you, baby? And <laughs> that's it. The game tells me I didn't do Frieza. Did I make, like, the wrong choice here? Oh. Because I went it alone? In the sand arc? So that's, like, a... So I have to do it the other way. I have to, like, go at it with friends. So I start from the very beginning. <laughs> nice. Is that why there's no Namek map? I was really disappointed with that. What are you? What are you doing here? I'll, I'll work with you, Piccolo. I'll work with you, Piccolo. I guess. Oh, I need to borrow the Dragon Radar for a bit. Oh, uh, of course. Do it worse this time. I tried doing it worse. It didn't work out. Let's go. Think you can keep up with my flying Nimbus? You gotta be kidding. I'm a cut above the rest of you puny humans when it comes to flying. The Ginyu Force battle was so tough. That shit was rough as fuck. 
Is this the real Super Saiyan 8 Vegeta fight that everybody is getting locked up on? Rats locks locks up the kidnapped Gohan inside a space pod. Goku aims to land a surprise attack, but Raditz detects him using a scouter. His scooter. Now Goku must face Raditz head on. The Goku Black story has a bunch of branches. That's oh, sick. Kakarot. I thought you'd at least be smarter than this. But you have no idea how out of your league you are. <gasps> Goku feet for free. Let's get the pleasantries. We're here to take you down. Simple as that. I'm sorry, brother. I was thinking about my offer and I've changed my mind. You'd probably just slow the rest of us down. And for betraying the Saiyan race, you will die! You gotta get off your phobia. Wait, what your phob what phobia? Since you're going to be eradicated anyway. Oh, I can't swap to Piccolo, that's a bummer. With you. The two Saiyans I mentioned earlier. They're even more powerful than Aww. me. I'm gonna grab him anyway. Impossible. <laughs> you could trade yourself for a lifetime and never even come close to that level. But since you Why is Raditz like got like heed my warning? You're not going to survive another day anyhow. <laughs> Wait. Oh. Yeah. Fuck you. How about this? I'm trying to like super counter him. How about this? Oh, now I can swap. I can actually swap to Piccolo here. Cool. Oh no. If you've got a new special attack hidden up your sleeve, now's the time to use it, Goku. <laughs> Sorry. No. Oh no. <laughs> Lazy fool. Not the counter again. Meanwhile, I've been training nonstop to develop a sure kill technique. For real? Yeah. Only problem is it takes some time to charge up before I can use Milo, how many phobias do you have? No, I'm you kidding. Fight him alone until then, if you can handle it. Gotcha. Fuck you. <laughs> Gotta get off your phone. <laughs> Bro's been on his phone all day. Shit. At least play RuneScape on the phone. He actually lost me. Yeah, Rats is harder than everything in the game, I swear to god, bro. Aren't I supposed to, like... It says I can swap to Piccolo, but I can't. Game's lying to me. Well, I won. I guess? I won. <laughs> yeah. What did we do to win? <laughs> we won somehow. Say goodbye, but I didn't die. Okay. Power level 1307. Don't hurt my dad. The game wasn't even close to over yet. I was kind of winning that actually. Leave him alone. Ah! <laughs> and why does Raditz have like armor? No, stop. Please. Don't do it. He's Please, just a He's just a, just a oh, child. Is that what you were going to say, Kakarot? Don't worry, brother. You'll see your son again in the next world. What, you little P Piccolo? Your attack! Do it now! Ah, are you insane? Maybe, but it's the only way to beat you. I think that's one of the what ifs, right? Like if I killed Raz before the waiting. special beam cannon. Ready? Special beam cannon! On this planet, we have these things called the Dragon Balls. What? Gather all seven, and together they have the power to grant any wish, even if it's bringing someone dead back to life. Wow, Vegeta. You can all go to hell. Still, I thank you for the information. <laughs> Everything that has happened here today has been transmitted <laughs> to my two Saiyan comrades deep in outer space. When they've learned that I've been killed, they'll come to avenge me. 
the other two Saiyans? When, when will they arrive here? How long? One year. Just one short year. <laughs> Damn. T two of them? Even stronger than him? How sweet does that victory taste now? They're going to wipe you all out. They'll soon have you writhing in agony like the worms you are. <laughs> <laughs> Piccolo just looks like... Yeah, why why'd you why'd you gloat in front of him? You shouldn't have done that. <gasps> Nappa and Vegeta, again. After Goku perishes in the battle with Rats, Kami arranges for him to train on Ki King Kai's planet. And just as Rats said, within a year the two Saiyans came to Earth. Finally, having completed his training on King Kai's planet, Goku is revived by the Dragon Balls and returns once more to the battlefield. Cyberman, no, not Yamcha. No! <laughs> Unable to escape, Yamcha dies in the explosion that induced by the self-destructing weapons the Sands had made. One by one, the other warriors also fall at the hands of the terrifyingly powerful Sands. Just when all hope seems to be lost, Goku arrives on the scene. <laughs> How's it feel seeing your little friend's corpse has scattered all over? There was another one, but there's probably not a scrap of him left. <laughs> I love Nappa. Nah. <laughs> he looks like it's such a... <laughs> he looks so right silly, ahead. and he talks so silly, too. <laughs> that stupid look on your face just makes me want to kill you faster. You'll pay for this! You'll both pay! You bastard! Out of my way! Vegeta! <laughs> What does the scouter say about his power level? It's over 9,000! What? 9,000? That scouter's a piece of junk! It's gotta be a mistake! It doesn't matter. That was a sick combo. Like you can't do anything against the mighty Nappa! Kaioken! Bro, Raditz actually bodies me unironically. I have no idea what the fuck it is. Greatest Goku, show that muscle head who's boss. Get him, Dad. Fuck it, spirit bomb. Oh. Oh shit, that's a different type of spirit bomb. That's pretty fucking sick. Oh, damn. Okay. Just, just finish him with some key blasts. Oh, you you want you want me to, to punch you once? I'll grab you. I'll kill you with the grab. Come on. Here we go. Here we go. <laughs> Dude, how is it that Raditz has given me probably the most trouble out of every character in this game? Help me, Vegeta. Help me, Nappa. You're weak. That was a cool spear bomb one. They made Nappa, Nappa super ass. Well, Nappa, for some reason, Raditz had like an armor in that first battle there. So he couldn't, he kind of had like great ape armor or something. Where I had to hit like a certain damage threshold before I comboed him. But Nappa here just like felt like a normal character. no use for a paralyzed Saiyan. Kill him, Vegeta. You're dead weight! You're not Nero. You're dead weight, Nero! He's a psycho. He, he, he just killed his own partner for no reason. Both of you need to get back to Kame House where it's safe. But, Dad, I... No, he's right. You saw what that other Saiyan can do. If we stick around, we'll only be getting in your dad's way. Sorry, Gohan. This guy's stronger than I thought he'd be. We oh, yeah, Vegeta's like a volcano attack. Two either. Is it because it reminds you of Akuma's super from Third Strike? Okay. I understand oh, Nappa's. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. 
Vegeta gets dirty fireworks, yeah. I did that a couple times. Vegeta becomes enraged as he watches Nappa being beaten to a pulp by Goku, unable to control his wrath. He murders his comrade. Sensing the immense danger looming, Goku tells Gohan and Krillin to return to the Kame house immediately. Then, as Krillin requested, he moves to the battle to another Let's location. Someplace else. Fine by me. Makes no difference. Goku selects a location devoid of human or animal life to challenge Vegeta to a one on one battle. Okay, this spot should do. From what I can tell, there's no people or animals nearby. Interesting. Of all the places on your planet, you chose this as your. Oh, so it's like the, the thing that he does where he goes like two fingers up and like explodes. Yeah. <laughs> you should feel lucky. Not every low class warrior gets the chance to spar with a super elite like myself. Not long after Saiyans are born, their skills as a soldier are tested. The scum whose scores are ranked the lowest are sent to the outer worlds, where the opponents are weak. Much like you were, Kakarot. I don't know, man. Brawly's in the outer worlds, and he's fucking strong. Words, you were cast out like a dog. Yes, and as a result, I was lucky enough to come here to Earth. I'm grateful for that. Besides, even a lower class outcast can surpass an elite if he puts his mind to it. <laughs> it's a nice attempt at a joke. Now let me show you a wall that you will never have the ability to scale through effort alone. What what wall, Vegeta? I've already scaled this wall. You better be fucking sick. Oh shit! Rush attacks have to be dodged, right? Oh no. That's fine. Damn! Fucking hits the super counter immediately. Oh my god. I'll charge all the way if you let me. I do not give a fuck. He's not really peppering me that much, so. Nothing cost me this world, Vegeta. But your insolence. <laughs> Oh. Vegeta. I tried to fucking super counter that. Oh, missed the follow up. Oh well. Oh. oh, I tried to grab him. It worked, though. Damn, okay. Oh, I tried to grab him out of the solar flare. I thought that'd be really funny. Oh, that was actually... So does the solar flare just fuck up the targeting of the opponents? Can he just like not see me for a moment? That's really funny. Of course he can super counter me though, right? Of course the enemy has super counter, it's fucking fine. That's why the input for the instant super- what's the super thing? Oh, it's just super dash again while holding neutral. So you just press, um, what is it, R2 and X just twice with no input on the control stick. If you have any directional input, it won't come out. It's been a hard fought battle, but summoning his last ounce of strength, Goku manages to counter Vegeta's stack. Though Vegeta was hit, Goku can still sense a trace of his key remaining. Yajirobe emerges from his hiding place, but Goku instructs him to flee. Sure enough, Vegeta rises once more, 
ready to challenge Goku again. Goku believes his only chance for victory is to use a spear bomb. However, Vegeta has a secret technique, known only to this to this, only to Sans up his sleeves. Oh no. There's also a move for like There's a move for changing your orientation as well. When you're like trying to trying to hit people. But now you'll learn firsthand what a Saiyan is really capable of. Did you feel that? There's a tremendous energy and it's swelling up even bigger. Where's your eyes get that? Back there. Go on, hold up. I'm going to. Wait. <laughs> Don't blink, Kakarot. These will be your final moments before I crush you. You won't crush me. Am I losing my mind? He turned into a giant monkey. monkey. <laughs> this is crazy. Giant I monkey Vegeta. <sighs> Since when were we dealing with a hundred foot tall monster? Yeah, I think Solar Flare like detargets the the other player though too. No other options left. Goku decides. To use the technique that King Kai taught him. Only choice now is to gather energy from all over the earth and make a spirit bomb. Spirit bomb wins every time. Oh shit! After all this time, I get it. The monster that killed Grandpa and the one that destroyed the tournament arena. All, all of that was, was me. I owe this to you, Gramps. I need to beat this guy. No matter what. I, I'll have to use every ounce of my energy for the tiniest chance of victory. Oh my god, whatever. Kao Ken, baby. If I die, I'll see you in really, it doesn't really do anything. Okay. At least I'll meha, to meha. apologize to you. What meter do I? Oh, he wins a sparking. <laughs> well, that really did not work that well, Vegeta. Oh shit, I tried to combo something different. Oh, I don't get, um... I can't do a rush attack as a big character, right? I was expecting to do the spirit bomb attack, but I didn't have it. Okay. I think I have enough meter, right? I'm just gonna full charge. Fuck him. He can't hit me up here. Fucking A. I keep doing the launcher on accident there. We we really struggling on this, right? Oh shit! I did the Kaioken again. Oh no! I'll full charge. Oh perfect. Oh oh fuck! I didn't get my thing. That's unfortunate. I might actually die. I did the same thing. I keep going for the fucking Kaioken. That's so fucking dumb. I'm fucking up. <laughs> I keep going for the Kaioken super instead of the Kamehameha. I would have had him dead. Wait, you are you supposed to lose? Damn. Goku falls to Vegeta's attack. With all that remaining warriors of, of Earth also defeated, the planet comes under Vegeta's tyrannical control. Oh, that's just a different cutscene. That's cool. Okay. After all this time, I get it. The monster that killed Grandpa. And the one that destroyed the tournament arena. All, all of that was, was... Was me? I owe this to you, Gramps. Me, Goku? I need to beat this guy. No matter what. I, I'll have to use every ounce of my energy for the tiniest chance at victory. 
If I die, I'll see you in the next world. At least I'll get to apologize to you. Oh no. You crushed me. Oh, I think I I think I have to eat this, right? Yeah. The combo. I'll full charge if you charge. Try to fight me. Oh, perfect. What? Whatever. Oh shit. Oh shit. Shit, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm dead. Well, fuck. Well, you can do that. The final hit of the rush combo on big bodies. Um, no, and yes. Uh, you start ignoring the big body armor in sparking, from what I can tell, as well as uh, if after you break the damage threshold, you can combo them. Lower the difficulty. We ain't no bitch. I don't think I can do the circle hit though at the end of it. All, all of that was was me. I owe this to you, Gramps. I need to beat this guy, no matter what. I, I'll have to use every ounce of my energy for the tiniest chance at victory. If I die, I'll see you in the next world. At least I'll get to apologize to you. I don't have the ability to do the thing there, but yeah. Oh man. Oh, sh that did not work. He should have punished me harder, but he does not care. We're going to Kaioken instead. Oh no. He's not going to true combo me into super though, so that's fine. I can't even like see what the fuck's going on right now. I can't build up enough key to do much of anything, so I'm trying to get out of here so I can see my see what the fuck's going on, bro. I'm just trying to like get out of here. I kind of just want key, bro. I'm like stuck. Actually, I fucking can. What if I just command him? Man? <laughs> Do it again. <laughs> Double Kamehameha combo. Learn that one. Extra, you hit circle or B for the finisher that closes. Yeah. But sometimes you want to charge the key, especially like here, because if you can get sparking against like the CPUs and they they just they just break. They don't really know what how to play the game after you get into sparking. They're just like, uh, let me not block or play anything anymore. 
Solar Flare! That's exactly how I killed him in the fight. To my time, Goku that he needs, Goku uses his Solar Flare on the Great Ape before him. What if you use Solar Flare against Jiren? Would he die? Goku then makes a run for it, getting as far away as he can. Okay, I think I put enough distance between us. Gathers all a little key from all living creatures on Earth to fire one final shot in the hope of turning things around. Give me your energy! When this when this aired on Toonami, wasn't that like the worst wait ever? You had to wait so long for the spirit bomb to happen. It was like every episode it was like is Goku still charging. Kakarot. Even if you do manage to come back to life, this miserable planet won't be around anymore. Die! Damn. Consider that a little farewell present. I don't have the strength to lift a finger. So just do what you're gonna do. So the other fight I had, so I had to solo this one. The other one I was able to like change between characters and shit. Damn you, I thought it was just an alternate like storyline. Just for that, I'm going to crush you like a grape! Yeah! <laughs> Why don't I kick it up a notch? Oh. <laughs> What's that I hear? Every bone in your body breaking? Must hurt. <laughs> I think your friends are here. How quaint! Krillin, get him with the Destructo Disc. Hey, Uncle. You put my dad down right now! Oh, <gasps> Gohan! Oh shit, wait a minute. I kind of started hearing the Guile theme for a moment. Yajirobe, who is waiting for the right moment, attacks. He leaps out and slices off Great Ape Vegeta's tail. Vegeta returns to his regular form, however, Goku remains incapacitated and neither Krillin nor Gohan stand a chance against even a weakened Vegeta. Calling Krillin to his side, Goku entrusts him with the spirit bomb. All that's left is to wait for an opening to use it. This what? It. This must be the spirit bomb. It's all up to you now. Krillin uses the spirit what bomb. What are you doing just standing there? You gonna throw the dead thing or what? <gasps> No choice now. Take this! Ha! He's like surfing on it. Uh, bounce it back, Gohan! I promise! It won't hurt you! It's our spirit bomb. I really like that version of the spirit bomb though, it's so cool looking. Monker. Vegeta survives a spirit bomb. Caught by the light of Vegeta's small false moon, Gohan transforms into a great ape and proceed proceeds to corner him. Krillin is just about to finish Vegeta off once and for all. When Goku stops him, telling him to let him go, having narrowly escaped death, Vegeta departs Earth. Now aware of the existence of planet Namek, <laughs> finally, Krillin, Gohan, and Bulma believe it may hold a new set of Dragon Balls. With what fucking proof? As Goku needs more time to re recuperate, the three set off for Planet Namek. Oh well, I couldn't finish reading that between my hiccups and burps. <laughs> okay. Planet Namek arc. I get a choice here? Wait, why does it say Vegeta here? Vegeta Saga. Oh. So it kind of like fills out the map. I play different characters. 
like Vegeta has like his solo mission here. That's cool. And this is gonna be like Goku's, right? Here goes. Oh god, which one's the right pick? I don't want to fuck it up again. I kind of want to be on the main saga. We'll fight all of Frieza's squad again if we have to. About one month after the group set off on their journey, Goku receives an SOS from Planet Namek. With help of Yachirobi's Sensubian, Goku, now finally re fully recovered, boards the spaceship Bulma's father has prepared for him and sets off for Planet Namek. While on the spaceship, Goku continues his training before arriving on Planet Namek. He manages to break every limit to attain greater power than he's ever known. Wow, thanks. Freezer, Emperor of the Universe, makes his appearance on Namek in search of the Dragon Balls. A newly recovered Vegeta also arrives, hoping to lay his hands on the very same Dragon Balls. The Saiyans are a true warrior race! Don't underestimate us! <laughs> Zarbon. Vegeta may have taken out the Emperor's underlings, but Freezer soon calls in his elite team of fighters, the Ginyu Force. In response, Vegeta teams up with Krillin and the others, but even still, their fight with the Ginyu Force is no cakewalk. Goku arrives in the nick of time, ready to show the results of his training. I feel like this is going to be really easy after having to do the... BAMBE! Nut punch. Give me that cock, baby. Sorry, you were wide open, so I just went for it. <laughs> <laughs> How silly. We won. He's got his booty cheeks out Look, again. You guys have got a choice to make here. Either get off this planet and go home, or you're gonna wind up like your friend here. Did you hear that, Bertha? <laughs> I love how fucking stupid they are. And suddenly he's dishing up threats to the likes of us. Mm, he's got some nerve. I wish Sizzle. Sizzle was the guy who did the voice for Chase. Let's teach this old punk why the Ginyu Force are the most elite warriors in the galaxy. <laughs> I think Sizzle would have done a Scout. good job. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is what happens to morons who underestimate the Ginyu Force. <laughs> oh. Oh yeah, there's ground throws in this game too, if you didn't know that. I don't know why I'm not able to land it here. Wait, you interrupt my combo by mashing a super. Oh, he's just gonna fall all the way down into the ocean real quick. Okay, so Namek is a map. I didn't think Namek was a map. You keep, they kept asking you, but you're too busy playing WoW, so you told them to stop asking. Damn. Oh, it was just one. Oh, shit. I wouldn't have killed him so quickly. I thought it was both of them. I was gonna fight Birder right after. <laughs> that Ginyu Force fight really made me ready for anything at this point. Goku swiftly overpowers two members of the Ginyu Force. Actually, just one, but you know, I murdered him. Another manages to escape, but Goku has more than demonstrated the fruits of his training. He hears about the Dragon Balls from Gohan and the others. But before they can take action, Goku senses a strong key headed in the direction of, Ge of oh, I Goku, I guess. Goku tells the others to head straight for the Dragon Balls while he readies himself once more. It's time for him to put an end to Captain Ginyu. Berter and Ginyu. Oh, this is the guy, huh? His power level is only around five thousand. Oh, somebody tried to RMT with you? Never accept RMT, especially for a gold item. That's him, Captain. Don't be fooled. This freak's way stronger than that. Like, there are people who RMT in WoW, but, like, never RMT directly in-game like that. I would actually have just reported the guy. He must be capable of boosting his strength in the midst of combat. From what I can tell, I'd say his true power level is somewhere around 60,000. 60,000. 60,000? 60, 60, but that can't be. 
This guy's just a puny Saiyan. It's not unheard of. He could have a natural talent, or perhaps his abilities have been amplified by a mutation like us. Either way. Oh, I know you meant the voice acting sure thing. Be interesting. Oh, you meant for the voice acting thing. Oh, yeah, you should report. <laughs> re report Bandai Namco IRL to Blizzard. To then I'd find an opponent that I can finally demonstrate my full power on. So, are we gonna dance or fight? I want to dance, Goku. This game's fun, though. I like it. I'm enjoying it. Well, have fun, Kakarot. Petita, this is gonna be good. Oh. Oh well. I will assist. Damn it. Without Vegeta, this isn't exactly gonna be a cakewalk. I don't remember asking for help, Burner. I'm perfectly capable of fighting my own battles. But in again, and it'll be you Ooh. I pulverize. Understood? <laughs> oh my god. He was. It's it's so easy compared to what it was before. Yeah. What happened? Take it. Did I accidentally turn down the difficulty? I don't think I did. I don't think I did. Great Ape Vegeta was fucking me up a bit, so. Yeah, Naruto got banned from WoW because of you. Damn, why'd you fucking ban Naruto? Was he was he beating all the bosses by cheating and talking to them and with like roleplay? This is when Goku and Ginyu kissed. Suddenly, Captain Ginyu begins chuckling, then he lets out a deafening scream. In doing so, he triggers a technique that enables him to switch bodies with Goku. Now in control of Goku's body, Captain Ginyu heads back to his spaceship with his subordinate. Goku makes a desperate chase after them, but is hindered trapped in Ginyu's injured body. Guys, listen! That's not me, it's Ginyu! Using my body! The others arrive to find Goku battling his own body. Unknown to everyone, Vegeta has his own plans for Ginyu, but first. Seeing that Burger has lost his will to fight, Vegeta ruthlessly puts an end to his life. Vegeta, why? They couldn't even defend themselves! Shut up! You're too soft-hearted, Kakarot! It's kill or be killed! Damn, that's actually really cool still, though. After finishing off Burder, Vegeta shifts his attention to Ginyu, who has taken over Goku's now body. It's time to finish the job. Doria. Change now. <laughs> Please let this work. What? Oh no! Goku rushes to intercept Ginyu's body change technique. And is able to reclaim his own body just in the nick of time. Bastard. Again. How dare you! You ruined everything. I'm back to being me again. What? What the hell is going on? What does Kakarot think he's doing? I better swap with a fresh body and quick. <laughs> Yours will do, Vegeta. Here's the frog. Oh, or nothing. <laughs> Expecting Ginyu's plan, Goku throws a frog between Captain and Vegeta. What in the world? Whew, that was a close one. <laughs> frog Ginyu. I love that. And why can't I, I've always wondered why can't Ginyu swap out of the frog body? Is it just because the frog doesn't have access to like the same level of key like anybody else has. Goku's then put inside a me medical machine to recover. However, he can sense Vegeta and the others fighting nearby. Now, now get, get ready. ready. Ah! True Frieza. Meanwhile, Vegeta and the others sense an immense powder coming from their opponent, one that far exceeds their own. Just as he's marveling at Frieza's strength, Goku's treatment finishes and he is fully so healed. Hang on just a little bit longer. I'm on my way, guys. When Goku arrives at the raging battle, Vegeta is moments away from death at Frieza's hands. I, I'm begging you, please. Beat him for me. For the pride of our race. You must defeat him, please.
Please, he must die by a Saiyan's hand! And so the battle between Goku and Frieza begins. For is this perfect, Frieza? Help. Oh shit, it is. I can only imagine how hard that must have been for you to do. I may have hated you when you were alive, but I always respected your pride. And now, it's time for me to share that pride. Pride in myself. Pride in myself. I am a Saiyan that was raised on planet Earth. And in the name of every single Saiyan that you've made suffer, for them and all the people of planet Namek too, I will defeat you! And I would just love to see you try. Oh no, Freezer. Both of you, we need to get out of here and quick. We'll only be in the way. Go on, come on, hurry! Please don't die, Dad! Make Frieza pay for what he did! I got you, Gohan. Yeah. Oh shit. Yeah. I wasn't paying attention. Yeah. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I've ever felt this excited about the prospect of a battle in my entire life. Now I only need to decide how I'll kill you. <laughs> It's a combo, right? Yeah. I tried to super counter that. He has a lot of health. I'm doing combos. I got strings, baby. I'm working on it. I'm learning. That actually hurts. You make me feel bad. That reminded me of Gara. I'm not done yet. Damn. I was really hoping I wouldn't have to rely on this again. I want to win this fight. My only choice. I tried to punish that. It didn't work out like that. Spirit bomb. Ultimate blast technique unlock. Okay. So I think it wants me to use the spirit bomb now, right? Oh my god! I'm trying to like not get cooked. Oh shit, I'm dead. I'm not actually dead. I didn't mean to fucking rush at him. It worked out though. We're just gonna end it with Spear Bomb. Fuck it. Small combos. I hope this works. I hope it's enough. Is that the best you can do? Yes. Oh! Oh! The spirit bomb is for the win. That did that did max damage. Sick, okay. We got money. You guys we got more money. Goku Spirit Bomb has finally brought an end to the long and hard fought battle. At last, our heroes can rest, or so they think, until... No, it, it can't be. Frieza's alive! No, please. Piccolo! I advise against placing too much stock in your escape. Though if you like, I can bring you closer to home. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Dude, there is nothing like seeing this happen. It was fucking crazy. I think the brat should go next. Holy shit, you, this looks so good. You ruthless, heartless bastard! Go, take Piccolo <laughs> with you and get out of here now. Find Bulma, find the spaceship, and go. 
do as I tell you right now before I lose what little sense of reason I have left. Damn. Super Saiyajin. Let's go. Overcome with pure rage at seeing Krillin die before his very eyes, Goku transforms into a legendary Super Saiyan. Once again, the trumpets of battle sound. Frieza, whose body can survive the vacuum of space, has decided to launch an attack powerful enough to, to destroy planet Namek in its entirety. With five minutes until planet Namek's extinction, Frieza finally reaches full power. His power is expanding even more than his muscles. That's right. This really must be 100% of his full power. That's right. Frieza like bulges muscles during this part too. It's weird. It also may be the only chance I'll ever have to fight him. If he really is the strongest being in the whole universe. Goku's cheeks look kind of chubby here. He looks kind of chubby cheeked up. Krillin can't be brought back to life with the Dragon Balls a second time. And I refuse to take the death of my best friend sitting down. Exactly, Goku. Best friend. And Frieza took him from me. He killed him in an instant. Like he was nothing. 85% now. 90. Frieza, just know the only reason I'm letting you reach full power is because I want to beat you at your best. With no regrets for either one of us. I know you want the same thing. You're itching to see what your 100% full power is capable of. Otherwise, you would have blown up the whole planet by now. <laughs> oh no. My apologies for the wish. As requested, this is my full power. Then do you want to finish this? Or are you just going to keep talking? Here it goes. Me, Get fucked, Frieza. Let's go. Holy shit. Just like I did that No, I'm going right into sparking. If you're gonna let me. Are you talking about Krillin? Don't you dare say his name! Huh. Oh. Got him still. It's fine. Meteor smash, baby. I'm serious, King Kai. You have to let me finish this battle with Frieza, or I'll never forgive you. Oh, I tried to perception that actually. I was going to guard it, and then I was like, wait, if I guard it. Because you get a, um, you get a, uh, a key boost for using perception on an attack like that. Oh, I missed my timing. Oh, I tried. Okay. Fuck it. We ball. Of course he dodges. It's fine. Now I'm angry. Oh, that puts you right into sparking. Kill him then. But just like the anime, baby. Goku Demon Sweat. <laughs> that was cool. He's dead now. Don't worry, guys. Freezer can't hurt you. I'll protect this chat room with my life. Perform successful Z counters 30 times. Nice. I'm getting better with the defense in this game for sure. <laughs> oh, the irony. He who triumphs loses everything while the vanquished escapes. I hate to gloat, but there's a lesson here on the virtue of mercy. Its only value is to your foe. We'll see about that. Damn. I am Lord Frieza, the most powerful being in the universe. Which is why. Which is why. 
Damn, that's right. Freeze is a cheater. After a desperate struggle, Goku defeats Frieza. He tries to escape from the crumbling remains of planet Namek. But the spaceship he's he's found it is too damaged to be piloted. Luckily, he spies a pod piloted by the Ginyu Force. With that safely with that safely, but narrowly escapes planet Namek. Okay. Yet the pod is not headed for Earth. It is de destined for planet Yarden, and Goku learns a new technique. This is when he learns instant transmission, right? Android slash cell art. Oh, we can just start it. Cool. I was like, I pressed the X thinking it would just automatically start. Oh boy, it's our boy. One year has passed since the Battle of Freezer on planet Namek. Freezer has survived and come to Earth seeking revenge, however, a mysterious young man suddenly appears before him. He has purple hair, so... Was Mecha Frieza canon? I don't remember Mecha Frieza being canon. Yes, so. The young man then transforms into Super Saiyan just like Goku and annihilates Frieza instantly. At the same time, Goku, who's on planet Yarden after his escape from Namek, returns to Earth. The youth tells Goku his name is Trunks and he has come from the future. He warns that in three years, androids built by the Red Ribbon Army will arrive. Apparently, in the future, Trunks, Trunks' friends have been murdered and Goku has died at the hands of a virus. So, he has come to give Goku some medicine for his illness. After telling Goku that he will come to their aid when the androids arrive, Trunks returns to his own timeline. Goku is determined to fight alongside his friends to advert the coming catastrophe in their future. Well, goodbye, future Trunks. What do you say? Want to train with me and Gohan? I've been raring to fight you again. Sure, sounds good to me. Krillin, what about the rest of you guys? Thanks, but I'm gonna head to Master Roshi's and train with him. I yeah, he's more your speed, Krillin. Oh. Well, okay. He's more hair speed. Don't, you know, don't don't come hang out with the boys anymore, Krillin. Three years passed, and the fated day of May twelfth has finally come. Goku and the others gather at the time and place Trunks gave them. They settle in to wait for the androids' appearance, but before they knew it, they're already here. Up there in the sky, he was attacked from above. Goku and the others couldn't even sense the androids before they started landing on the streets. Suddenly, Goku senses that Yamcha's key is rapidly fa fading again. <laughs> they arrive to find him barely alive, having suffered a mortal blow at the hands of the androids. We'll fang fist! Right, that's his move. Goku leaves Krillin with an injured Yamcha and faces and turns to face the androids. Okay, cool. I wasn't able to finish reading that. I'm bad. There are too many innocent people here. Let's take this somewhere else. You agree to that at least? <laughs> Too many innocent people? Well, that is a problem which can be easily corrected. Stop it! You bastards! <laughs> it was my understanding you wanted the streets free of onlookers. Evidently, our solution does not please you. That's it! Follow me and we're gonna settle this! Follow me. Why? Why do they listen to Goku when he tries to get them to leave, like, innocence alone? Goku leads the androids to a deserted area, away from the town they were trying to destroy. Once at a safe distance from humanity, Goku questioned the androids about how they knew the details about him and the others. As it turns out, Android 20 has been studying Goku and his friends ever since he defeated the Red Ribbon Army in order to learn how to defeat them. He informs them that over time he has analyzed and come to fully grasp the power they wield. Android 20 is confident that victory will be his, but Goku only grins in response. If all you know about me is from before I went to Namek, 
You're about to be in for a real shock. That's true. Oh, we're really just busting out Super Saiyan like this. You guys stay out of this. If I'm the one these guys want, then that's a cool that's shot. They're gonna get a most intriguing discrepancy. This dormant power. It departs rather considerably from the data previously compiled, but it is not remotely discouraging. His strength is within manageable parameters. Android number 19 shall now operate as your executioner. Is that right? Fine. Then get over here and fight me. Then get over here and fight me. Okay, Goku. I missed my timing there. Damn, I have to be on my my fucking toes there. Amazing. His strength is immeasurable. This super saiyan transformation put Goku on a level far beyond us all. <laughs> we'll see. Angry Kamehameha. What is that? Oh. Oh shit, it's the Frieza one. That's sick. Is it? Is it no use? You're kind of trash, bro. Bro, you're kind of trash. Bro's kind of trash, not gonna lie. You think you're gonna handle me? Yamcha outfit too? Let's go. We needed more Yamcha fits. Proficiency? Let's go. Goku loses consciousness after his battle with the androids. I don't think so. I think we kick their ass. Once he's been given the medicine from Trunks, he comes to a few days later. During that time, Android 16, 17, and 18 awaken, and to make matters worse, a creature named Cell has appeared, seeking the ultimate power. It is through absorbing Android 17 and 18 that Cell plans to attain his perfect form. Now aware of his foes, Goku enters the hyperbolic time chamber so he can complete one year of training in just a single day. If I want any chance of winning battles to come, then I need to train hard enough to find a level beyond Super Saiyan. Goku explains his training plan to Trunks and Vegeta, and the two of them enter the, the chamber first. A day passes, but then Goku senses an impending battle. It started. Piccolo's getting ready to fight. Yeah, but who? Do you think it's so? No. Oh, yeah. Whoever it is, I can't sense their energy, so it's got to be one of the other androids. Stop, Gohan. We can't help it. We're nowhere near their level right now. All we do is slow Piccolo down. <sighs> Slow Piccolo down. Dad, that energy! It, it's gotta be Cell! He's on the move! Okay, so... So going and helping is the split, right? Sure. Sure, we'll do the split. If I use my instant transmission... I might be able to get Piccolo out of there. Thanks, Dad. Please save him. Fingers to the forehead. Let's go. Goku's friends sense that Cell's approaching Piccolo's location. He uses instant transmission to hurry to Piccolo's side. They arrive. However, Piccolo is attacked and mortally wounded by Cell. Seeing their friend hurt, Goku and Gohan fly into a range that marks the beginning of their battle with Cell. Mr. Piccolo, he, he's, oh no! Oh Stay no! Calm, Gohan. 
Try to sense his energy signal. You're right, I can still feel it. Mr. Piccolo is alive! I'll buy us some time. While I do, you rescue Piccolo and hurry back here. But be careful! Uh, okay! You're Goku, aren't you? That's funny. How did you get here all of a sudden? Well, what were those sounds in the background? The faintest trace of your energy. Was it Gohan moving? It's so dramatic for a show that revives people thousands of times with the Dragon Balls. The Dragon Balls are only supposed to, like, each set of Dragon Balls are only supposed to be able to revive a person one time. Supposed to. I don't remember the exact, like, how everything goes. That's for me to know. And, and for you, you to find, find out. out. Hilarious. Well, finding out isn't exactly high on my to-do list. It hardly matters anyway, since you'll soon be more bio extract for me to drink up. Go ahead and try me then, Cell. Oh no. Are we just gonna body Cell first form with, Go with way, Super Saiyan Goku? Go oh, never mind. Not yours. Yeah. Oh shit. I was trying to focus too hard on comboing there. Goku, let me back you up. Thank you, Tien. Tien's here to help us. Get ready to see my real I don't think we need Tien's help here. <laughs> Fuck it, we ball. <laughs> that looked really funny on Cell. He's all the way in the water. Look at him, shit. Hit him with six tri beams. That that would be cannon though. Allow number seventeen to be absorbed. Sixteen? You're actually gonna fight too? By my calculations, Cell and I are approximately equal in power. What? Oh shit! Fuck you! <laughs> that worked as a straight counter to his fucking super. That's great. We won. We won. <laughs> I was kind of hoping for a beam clash, but I don't think... I think it only works against, like, ultimate beams, right? Nice. Android 17's proficiency... Wait, we had the androids on our team? Sick. <laughs> Goku and friends have successfully defeated Cell, but now the androids stand before them. Since their common enemy is, <laughs> has been done away with, the androids return to their original objective to try and kill Goku. However, the androids have suffered damage with their from their battle with Cell. Listen, your bodies are way too injured <laughs> to be fighting right now. I'm not going anywhere, so why don't you rest up and we can do this another time? The hell are you talking about? These little scrapes are nothing. We could still take you easy. Yeah, don't throw me any sympathy. I haven't had a scratch. I, oh, uh, huh? Is, huh? What's that supposed to mean? Well, not naming numbers, but one of us was hogging all the Her voice feels off. And ended up with a couple boo-boos. So step aside and let a lady stretch her legs. Bo both of their voices feel off, but hers especially. <laughs> yeah, whatever. You got any problems with that, 16? Negative. Good. Glad we're on the same page. Tian Chen Han, would you let me take this one on my own? Of course. Just be careful, Goku. Do I get to 1v1 all the androids now? Hey, I don't give a crap. Go ahead. You can both attack at the same time. It's no skin off my back. No way! You being as strong as you are is actually why I want to fight you one on one! I want oh to shit, she's actually like bodying me a little bit. Matches up with yours. That's all. <laughs> Don't start getting ahead of yourself. Oh shit. That's a good that was good shit. Oh no. Oh 
Oh. Nice try. Okay, my timing is off for that. I'm doing it too fast. You can extend combos extremely long. OG Kid Goku being voiced by OG Kid Gohan gives you whiplash like you wouldn't believe. Yeah. I tried I tried playing OG Kid Goku in ranked and I, I won my ranked match, but yeah, it uh it gave me whiplash too. Fuck it. We won. We win. We have to get the diamond DLC. Just to not throw a hook. Is have you watched Daima yet? Blood was asking me about it, and I didn't watch. I haven't watched the first episode or anything. Daima Goku will have the all the correct VAs. Got it. Though inferior in power, Goku taunts Android 18, all while remaining perfectly calm. That allows him to gain the advantage in their fight. Android 18 soon realizes she is losing and decides to abandon her fight with Goku. Ugh. That's enough. Now my clothes are all dirty. You've heard mix with Daima? Okay. Wait, you're done? That was so quick. Untouchable as I am. Damn, she didn't last I long. I don't get that much of a kick out of fighting. Had enough time to lick your wounds? <laughs> you know androids don't run out of energy like that. I swear, you're the naggiest sibling in the world. They're putting up a much better fight now. Must have really got their head back in the game. Maybe from watching me against 18. Gotta say, Goku, you're as impressive a martial artist as the doctor said. That, and you're not nearly as annoying as that hothead, Vegeta. What you say about you Vegeta? Cool throughout that whole fight with 18, too. Making an android with unlimited energy sweat is quite an accomplishment. I've never had more fun. Okay. He wants to have fun. <laughs> Oh shit. Oh my god. Oh, I got out of it. No more screwing around. Take this. Now I'm mad. You got it. Take this. You close. I'm not done yet. Fuck it. Here it goes. Fuck it. We ball. Super command man. Oh, he just dodges it. Yeah, I had a feeling. Where's he going? Get ready to see my real strength. Now I'm gonna do it again. This time it's gonna hit. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh -oh. He's dead. <laughs> I'm kind of just wiping the floor with him. He has. Only let my guard down for a second. Goku has an easy way into sparking, which is really funny. It gives him buffs, but it also like spends just it spends three bars, but it gives him buffs and sparking, and then you just kind of auto win. Pretty nice. Realizing he can't defeat Goku, Android 17 lowers his guard. However, his expression seems somewhat pleased. Android 17, who had searched for Goku as if it were a game, feels like he had enough fun with the fight. I think I'm a little burnt out on all the fighting today. Let's get out of here. Those, those, those are Android 17's words. The Android 16's 18. Android 16's gaze remains displeased as he stares at Goku. Do you want to fight What's too, Android 16? We going or what? Damn. Sixteen, what got into you all of a sudden? You look pissed. My mission is to kill Goku, and I intend to accomplish it. Dude, chill. <laughs> Dude, chill. Calm down. I will end your existence 
for it is the only purpose of my existence. He almost sounds like Kronk. Everyone and everything else is secondary. <clears throat> okay. Then it's now or never. He really kind of sounds like Kronk from... Oh, shit. I can just chill. It's fine. Trying to recover. Here it goes. Oh, I'm base Goku now. I didn't even realize that at first. Well, I'm base Frieza Saga Goku. Right. Really, just have to do that like that. I'm getting excited. Oh, I tried to just raw grab. Oh shit. Disengaging limiter. Oh wait. Oh fuck. I must use my last resort. Oh. Oh. Guys, that's it. 17 and 18. Farewell. <laughs> that's it. That's Okay. You see that shit? He just <laughs> it lands his one super and it fucking insta kills both of us. I have to just be ready to dash out of that shit. Fuck it. Give me your energy. Are you just gonna let me charge in front of you? Mister. Well, goodbye. My people need me. Come back here, Android. Shots here. Do it again. Oh man, I'm getting better at it though. This has that counter attack, which is really annoying to deal with. Yeah, into the water with you, bitch. Grab him. Oh. I'm getting excited. Oh my god. I'm trying to like break out of the combo with the thing. Ow. Oh my god. This is so annoying. Dude. Are you fucking kidding me? How many times can he... How many times can we fucking counter each other? Useless. 
Like, how many fucking times can we, like, counter over and over again? This is, like, like some actual Dragon Ball bullshit, for sure. Yeah, until you run out of key. I know, it's just... The AI countering me, like, eight times in a row and me countering it back is just, like... Fucking wild to me. Oh, I whiffed my spirit bomb? That's sick. I'm gonna fucking die now. Did you do a slap counter? Uh, I think we did. Like, multiple times. I think we did the, uh... Like, we slap counter each other's slap counter. Fuck it. He's gonna eat it, right? Oh, I'm dead. Damn, that was going so well. And then he just like, he bodied me out of nowhere. Okay. Cause I did the super counter like, we did like the super counter like twice in a row against each other. What? Your energy with me. He blocked my combo, my combo. That, 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 that spirit bomb's not gonna work, I don't think. Oh, never mind. He tried to block it. Man. Oh my god. Dude, throw a beam at me or something. Fuck it, spirit bomb punish. Hopefully this works. It did. Spirit bomb punish worked. <laughs> Share your energy with me. All right. Where are you, mister? Man, really? Oh my god. I think that worked. I know, I'm not sure, but I think that did work. We landed three spirit bombs. Easy game, dude. Told you we'd win. It all comes down to this. Android 16, you're dead. It doesn't come down to anything. You're fucking done. I just obliterated you. Don't you dare, 16. I'm not letting you blow yourself up. <sighs> he did blow himself up. That was really that was a fun like lost condition. Device inside of you as well. I I told you both before. My sole mission is to kill Goku at any cost. Then why haven't you already? You could wipe this entire island off the map with that explosion. Hmm. True. That's enough. You can't beat me in the state you're in now. Hmm. And besides, you don't really seem like a bad guy. <laughs> he says to the walking nuclear bomb. Even if you're technically a robot, I could feel your intent to kill. But if it really is your mission, why didn't you go for it during the fight with Cell? Instead, you chose to defend your fellow androids, which means... It's simple. Yes, there Kronk. is much wildlife living all around this island. I did not want to obstruct nature with the fallout of our battles. <laughs> but hear nice. me, Goku. One day I will fulfill my purpose. You took care not to harm any innocent life. 
animal nor human. I believe you are both good people. I have enjoyed traveling together. Well, who says we can't still keep doing it? Then you know what? Let's have our first stop by the mall. I'm in desperate need of some new, less filthy clothes. <laughs> they all became friends, bro. It looks like the battle is over. Yep. Goku! We're Cell! And the androids! And, uh, uh, 18! You, <laughs> you didn't defeat them all already, did you? What, what about 18, Krillin? Hmm? Well, I think they'll be back. Huh? Eh. <laughs> In the wake of Cell's defeat, the three androids depart. Peace is once again restored, thanks to Goku and his friends. Someday, these powerful artificial humans may show their faces again. But when they do, will they be friend or foe? Whatever the outcome, Goku is sure to be stronger than ever and ready to defend the world. Damn. Easy game. That was fun, though. That was cool. I'm guessing that was another one of the, like... Yeah, the changing future, yeah. So he changed the future. The androids by like making them friendly. So the other, the other option here is like go and help. Huh? There's apparently another route here. So one route's defeating Cell. Is the other route losing to Cell? They both lead up to the same area, don't they? Oh, it's not like it really matters. guess maybe like if I lost to Cell. Cell is really easy. Yeah, no, I was on the normal difficulty. Okay. Crazy. It felt like certain parts of this became like really, really like easy after I got like Super Saiyan. There wasn't really much of a threat. But yeah, thanks everybody for watching. Thanks for being here. Thanks for hanging out. If you're new around here, make sure you click that follow button. Subscribe if you're on the YouTube. All that kind of stuff.